So, if I win this fight, I'm sure I'm gonna win this fight. Matapos ang kanyang matagumpay na boxing kibyo sa ilalim ng MB promotion ng pambansang kamao na si Manny Pacquiao, April ng 2021, namuli mapakita na magkilas ng undefeated prospect na si Mark Magnifico magsayo. Matapos durogin sa kanilang laban ng American fighter na si Pablo Cruz by Port Round, Ripper Stoppage. Kaya naman, matapos ang dalawang sunod na agresibong panalo ng tubong taglibaran si City Bohol natupad ang pangarap na mapabilang sa undercard ni Manny Pacquiao kung saan sinagupan nito ang palaban ng Mexican fighter na si Julio Silla. Isang dating Latino Bantelweight at WBC Super Bantelweight champion na may agresibong professional record na 32 wins for losses at 28 wins by knockout. Taglay ni Siya kontra kay Magsayo ng 70% knockout rate at isang knockout loss daw ang ibibigay niya kay Magsayo. Eh, ganar for knockout. Win by knockout. Wow, he's predicting a knockout victory over Mark Magsayo. 2015, una itong mag-world champion kasunod ng kanyang pagkatalo noong 2016. 2017 ay panalo naman nito ang Bakanting WBC Servers Bantelweight title. Oh, Dalawa sa mga dito nakatikin ang pagkatalo kada Francel Masanilla at kay Remunia Rigundo noong 2018. Kasapit ng 2019 bago tumabla sa kanyang huling laban sa undefeated American fighter na si Brandon Pekahua para sa WBA World Super Bantelweight title. The decision is a split decision draw. Kaya naman hindi maitago sa Mexican fighter ang kasabikan na ito na makalaban ng ating pambato lalo na at halos dalawang taon itong nabakanti at ngayon susubukan tibagin ang featherweight division si Mark Magnifico Magsayo. Balikan natin ang naging laban ng ating kababayan kontra sa palaban na Mexican fighter na si Julio Silla na taas na o sinabi knockout down ang aabutin ni Magsayo sa laban at alamin kung paano nga ba nagawa takutin ni Magsayo ang mga boxing fans na nakapanood sa kanilang laban matapos itong brutal na pabagsakin si Sia na nagpatayo sa upuan sa karamihan Very accomplished Mexican Julio Cesar Seja waits over the last 12 years or so we remember him for his trip to Doncaster many years ago against Jamie McDonald. He's the former WBC Super Bantamweight Champion. And oh, how good shots. about that for a start from Magsayo? Well, we wanted something special and we might just get it within the opening 30 seconds. Julio Seja on his backside and Maxayo exploding into this one biggest test of his life and he has started on a mission Nagawa man o pabagsakin ni Maxayo ang Mexican fighter sa kanyang sa kanyang malinis na rip hook sa unang round pa lang ng bakan agad naman nakabawi si Sia sa mga sunod na round at nagbigay ito ng matinding pressure ay Magsayo na piniling munang iwasan ang pasugod na Mexicano. Magsayo, which is where he's based for so much of the time at the infamous wild card gym. Good left hook there from Seha. As a fighter was undefeated when he came over to fight Jamie McDonald. Brilliant win for the Doncaster man. Still got plenty about him. And he's recovered well, hasn't he? Just to apply a bit of pressure on Maxayo. Yeah, I mean, this is a really good round here. It's round two. Seha landing good body shots, trying to stalk Maxayo. Good body work again. Yeah, lovely. Good left hook there as well from Seha. Fainted the jab, lead left hook. The white and blue and the blue boots of Julio Seha. 
fights down the line more as a professional for Seha. He's been a world champion. He's seen it and done it. And he's still ambitious, but he looks full of beans and fire here. Yeah, I mean, you've got to remember as well that, that, that draw with Brandon Figueroa, that was, I think, he, he failed to make the weight for the Super Bantamweight, but Figueroa, Super Bantamweight world champion. Yeah, lovely. Up. Yep, left to the body from Seha. Who's that left hook long? Really reaches right behind the back of the elbow. Uppercut and a right hand as well from Seha. So, round five, tuloy lang ang kanyang pagsugod ni Seha sa naramdam na niya na tila tumutupin na ating kababayan. Sa walang tigil nito na pag-atake sa budiga ni Migsayo. Magamat nagagawa naman ng Pinoy na pigilan ang tuloy-tuloy na pinsa ng Mexican fighter sa kanyang job at counter lip hook. Palaban naman na nakalaban ni Migsayo na kung saan nagawa nito na makabawi sa ating pambato. Shot was lovely from Saya. Definitely felt that. Did Migsayo. And Saya will smell that. He'll know. He'll feel it in there. Right hand. He's looking very powerful here. Julio Seja. Can Magsayo cope in the heat of battle? I mean, Magsayo certainly having success himself. But I think what's really impressing me probably the most from Seja is... He's trying to keep Seja off him. Another body shot with the left hook from the Mexican. Yep. Seha hurting Maxayo here, these body shots, he's, be, he's mixed it oh, up. Oh, down he goes, Maxayo. Clapperboard came in. And the bell will save him here, the young Filipino. But it's been a torrid round as Julio Seha. But Julio Seha got himself together quickly, dusted off the knockdown, and has come back to largely control this map. Yeah, I think so. I mean... You know, you couldn't say Maxo isn't in the fight. He's having success. He's landing some jabs, but you see Carlos Castro in that really good opener. Nine Stone Brigade and so much success back home in Alahad and Lee Wood. Oh, good right hand. Nice work that from Maxio. Yeah, Utilized his reach there, didn't he? And the fast right hands. Yeah, timed that really well. Best shot he's landed for a while. Just slipped that side the jab and fired the right hand counter over the top. Three punch combinations together, that was good. Left hook, right hand, left hook, and then spun up. Withstand the pressure. And we will find out a little bit later on. Here's the ninth. It was a 10-8 round, obviously the first round to make Seho, and I gave him the seventh. But other than that, it's been, uh, I think Seho's won everything on my card, and there was the 10-8 uh, the round in the fifth. So I've gone well ahead. Really well. And you know, that left uppercut, right hook, uh, sorry, left hook, right uppercut combination, then that long left hook that he throws around the back. I thought after four or five rounds he might fall apart, Max Sayo, but he's withstood a great deal of punishment, especially downstairs, underneath those elbows. He had the power to really, dis you know, to deter Seha, Seha just coming forward. No real respect for what's coming back at him. You know, he's different and, and even... Sa pagpapatuloy ng ati bong bakbakan ang dalawang buksingero sa mga sunod na dalawang round, tila ba, kontrolado na siya ang tempo ng bakbakan. Piktibo man ang pasugod na diskarte ng Mexican fighter para bumagal si Magsayo sa laban, naging matatag ang Pinoy at nakabawi ito ng lakas para balikta rin ang sitwasyon sa bakbakan. Dito gugulatin ng magniti ko magsayo ang mga manunood na siyang nagpatayo sa upuan ng karamihan. Max Deluca, Lisa Jampa and Don Trella. I think Sayhas, you know, been quite dominant. He's boxed well, hasn't he? Yeah. Especially after the knockdown that Max Sayo can burst into life. Just leaning down on Seha there. Crowd getting excited. what you need to see from Max Sayo, don't you? As really he's quick, and a right hand has laid out Julio Seja, and it is over. Knocked out Julio Seja after a brilliant attack. Ang panalo nito na Max Sayo kay Seja na nagbigay sa ating pambato ng WBO International Federated Title. Bukod pa sa nakuha nito, ang karapatang hamunin bilang 
Mandatory Challenger sa WBC World Featherweight title ng kasalukuyan champion na si Gary Ransom Jr. Kasunod ng kanyang pagkapanalo, agad naman inumusta ni Magsayo ang nakalaban na Mexicano na nooy na ligtas naman sa anumang kapahamakan at nagpapalakas na lamang. How, how is it say ha? Oh, it is good. Everything okay. Ikaw idol, anong opinion mo sa video ito? Kung sakali hindi napatulog ni Magsayo si Sia, maaaring nga bang talo siya sa rabang ito? Para sa iyong comment, i-comment mo na yan sa ating comment section sa baba at kung nagustuhan mo naman ang video ito, paiwan naman ako ng like at pasuscribe na rin sa ating muntin channel. Maraming maraming salamat po sa iyong panonood. Saan man kayo naroon lang mag-iingat. God bless. Bye bye.